Hey guys, I'm back with another video, and in this video, I'm taking a look at a one-of-a-kind GPU stand for my RTX 2060 in my uh, NZXT H500i case. So I designed this thing in CAD um, using a free software um, called Fusion 360 by AutoCAD, and then I had it 3D printed, um, and it's an RGB um, prototype NZXT GPU stand. So this is what it looks like. I put in, um, so I designed this to fit where the GPU six pin power cable comes through the case. Um, and it has the NZXT logo, which I'll show you um, with the RGB. Um, the six pin power comes through there and into the GPU and then we have the stand to hold it up. So I just put some parchment paper in there just to diffuse the lighting a little bit through the logo. And then all I've done is just put a ASUS um, uh, addressable RGB um, cable in there that I bought off of Amazon for like $15, $20. Um, so I'm just gonna hook this up in the case and then I'll show you guys um, how it looks in the case and then sort of go through the design of it and uh, 3D printing it. So just installing it into the case. So as you can see here, we have our six pin power and then here's just the RGB uh, header. Uh, for the RGB uh, lighting strip. So that just gets plugged in there. And then the six pin power gets routed through, um, through the GPU stand. Eight pin power, I should be saying. I don't know why I'm saying six, six pin power. There we go, there. Just gonna route the cables back under the stand, plug the GPU in really quick. Powers in. All I have to do is just route this back down the stand. And then because it's designed for the H500i, I just need to unscrew something really quick. So it's meant to fit perfectly in the hole in the bottom of the case. It might be hard to see there. Um, but we have this hole right here where the power is coming through. So it just sits right in there and then locks into place under the GPU. And then all this is, so you see that little gap, this thing gets kicked back into place and releases um, in there so that there's no more gaps. And we're nice and closed off. And we'll see the logo lit up um, in a second. Just gonna get everything buttoned up and then turn the system on and show you guys how it looks. So looking into our CAD software, so that's Autodesk Fusion 360. Um, it's free with the .edu email, so if you're in school, uh, it's a great um, CAD software to just be able to play around with uh, and get your get your feet a little dirty in CAD and uh, you know designing some of your own uh, prototypes. So this is it in the software, and you can see so we have the NZXT logo. 
Um, and then everything is sort of built off of the base. So the base is meant to perfectly fit within that hole in the bottom of the case where the GPU stand comes, or the, the GPU cable comes through, a PCIe connector. And then inside, so that's the strongest part is where it's, you know, actually being in the case. And then everything off of that is pretty much just extruded up and we have the NZFT logo cut out. Um, a little extra extrusion here um, in order to make the gap between the GPU stand or the GPU, the back of the, the RTX 2060 and sort of the overall profile of our part. And then here is uh, just the lip to actually hold up the GPU and prevent it from sag. So here it is guys, all up and running. I think the NZXT logo looks really sick in there um, with the RGB on. And I can, I can of course change the RGB settings to, to be whatever color I'm looking to, to display um, and whatever RGB lighting mode I want to look at as well. But I think it just, it brings a different aspect to the case. You have the nice GPU stand in there, um, so you definitely won't get any GPU sag, which you're not too worried about with an RTX 2060, but this is more for aesthetics than, than anything else. Um, so if you guys like how it looks, um, if you like sort of this kind of thing where it's one of a kind, custom made PC components um, from CAD to 3D printing to the finished product that looks honestly amazing, um, then leave a thumbs up on this video and then please uh, leave some comments below if you if you like the video and you want to see more stuff like this that is awesome and if you haven't already subscribed to the channel because there will be plenty more videos like this and other tech and PC content so subscribe to the channel turn on notifications so you don't miss any videos